Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. Force here with some breaking gaming news. Valve has announced the Steam OS. This is a Linux-based operating system that is built to allow you to stream Windows and Mac games from your computer to any TV within your household. Now it is also anticipated that this Steam OS is going to be the native operating system of the Steam Box, although that has yet to be officially announced. Valve does have two more announcements coming throughout the course of this week, and it is anticipated that that will be one of them. But for now, let's talk about what exactly the Steam OS is and what it means to you as a gamer. So over the course of the past year, Valve has been making strides towards bringing the computer gaming experience to the living room. I mean, there's no question that the console, the on-your-couch gaming experience, is one of the biggest uh, pieces of the gaming market. I mean, consoles and their crowd are rather significant. But there's always been that disconnect between the openness of the PC and everything that that has to offer, and then these closed console systems from companies like Nintendo, Microsoft, and Sony. Well, Valve apparently is looking to bridge that gap. So not too long ago, they introduced Big Picture Mode. And Big Picture Mode was a way for you to take your computer gaming experience onto a television and play it with a controller at a further distance away, a distance that puts you at about 10 feet away from a screen, sitting, you know, sitting on a couch and, you know, it's big picture mode, everything's bigger, it's, it's more of a consoleized version to, to play your computer games. So from that, we've made now the transition into this new operating system. Now, according to Valve, this is an operating system that not only is going to make that streaming process easier through the use of a living room console device, which again is expected to be the Steam Box, but it's also got a very, very strong gaming focus. And that's something that Valve is touting to be one of the, the biggest, biggest strong points of the Steam OS. So according to the announcement page, uh, in the Steam OS, they've achieved significant performance increases with graphical processing. And they're also now working towards audio improvements as well. Uh, this will allow game developers to take advantage of these gains as they target the Steam OS uh, for their new and upcoming releases. So again, it's an operating system. You know, like you have Windows and like you have uh, iOS, it's an operating system, but one that is focused entirely on games. And it's also going to take advantage of all of the great things that Steam and, you know, PC gaming has to offer. All of the fantastic sales, the modability, and the, the, just the different options you have in terms of performance on varying levels of systems and stuff like that. And then, of course, there was also the recent announcement of Steam Family Sharing, which is going to come into play here. The family sharing system allowing you to share your PC games with uh, set individuals that you authorize. It will allow them to have access to your library and try out these games and maybe eventually buy them if they so desire as well. We'll also be getting some of the basics that you expect in something like this, like music, TV, and movies. Valve has stated that they are working with some of the larger media services that we know and love uh, that, to allow streaming of those, those different forms of entertainment. Uh, you know, this is pretty big, and this could actually potentially be a big shakeup in the gaming industry. And why is that? The, the OS itself, but what the OS is likely to be attached to, which is a Steam Box, which as far as I can tell right now, it's going to be a, a sort of a small PC built for the living room that again, will allow you to stream games from a computer and take advantage of everything the computer has to offer. I, I just think that this could really be a very big thing if they do it right, if they get a right price point. Once we find out, it is again expected that later this week, we're gonna find out exactly what the Steam Box is. That in conjunction with the Steam OS and everything that Steam has to offer and everything that PC gaming has to offer, and the openness, and that's one big thing that they are also touting. This is going to be very, very open. It's going to allow developers and publishers of games to much more easily make changes. We have the closed systems in Microsoft uh, and the Sony consoles. These things sometimes, are, there are significant barriers when it comes to developers pushing out updates to their games, for example. And because it's a lot easier to do that on PC, it will then be a lot easier to do it through Steam OS and again on the Steam Box once that eventually gets announced. Now we still have a few big major announcements to come throughout the course of this week and uh, once that does happen I'll be sure to update you guys as well. But th I think this is a step in a really exciting direction. You know, even if you aren't necessarily someone who likes to game 
on a couch in front of a TV, like the console gaming experience, this could be a big shakeup and, and this could be a really we're looking at potentially Valve entering the space of the living room and competing with Microsoft, Sony, and Nintendo. And whatever you feel about that and whatever your, some people may feel their capabilities might differ from someone like Microsoft and Sony, I would tell you this. More competition is always a good thing. The fact that Valve is making this play means that they must be confident in, in what they're trying to do. It's, it's quite exciting. Competition is great. It's only going to mean better things for fans of Microsoft, Sony, and Nintendo in the fact that we, we potentially have a new competitor in this market, in this space, which is the living room, the TV, consoleized gaming. And that is going to do it for this announcement video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Happy to bring you news of the Steam OS. If you haven't already, please be sure to subscribe for more great gaming news and coverage right here on the channel. Once again, this has been Force. Keep watching and keep owning.